Hi friends! I just hit a milestone with VIP Kid. I just got a new badge yesterday. 100 days! It has been 100 days with VIP Kid. I have some really awesome highs, but I'm currently experiencing a couple lows with VIP Kid. So this is my 100 day reflection with VIP Kid online teaching company. So to start with my positives, I have met some amazing students. I had had, hmm, there's one of my conflicts, but I have this pool of students. I have nine students that I have met, I have had class with, and they are so sweet, genuine and loving, and they just love to learn. So that has been a huge plus with VIP Kid. I have met some amazing students that I have really love to learn every day when their face pops up on my screen. I genuinely am excited to see them. If I'm feeling a little sleepy as I'm waking up, their face pops up and I'm like, oh, good morning it might be 5 a.m here and 5 p.m there but hello i'm so happy to see you and it is a true genuine enthusiasm and love that i have for these students so i love my awesome students. there is the new month booking feature that has happened this month as i have hit my 100 milestone it has been great to be able to say oh these are my classes that i'm going to have booked for the next month four classes at a time, one, two, three, four. Either you accept all four or you accept none of them. So I was really excited. I had five, six booking requests sent to me for an entire month. <laughs> yeah, I was totally for it. Yes, I will accept those month booking requests. I will adjust my schedule and move some things around so that I can get those bookings in. New pay scale that's come out. It has really shaken some people when it comes to um, the pay scale and VIP kids saying we are not going to be doing the same um, increase in pay for teachers. Well, it's the only pay scale I've ever known. I've only been with the company for 100 days. So I pretty much, that's where I started at. Um, I just accepted that that's what I'm going to get paid and I was very grateful that I can stay home with my small children and make some money. Um, you know, it, everyone knows their value and their worth and they know that they're worth more. And so knowing that that was the pay scale that I went, I was hired at, I just said, okay. Um, and I've accepted that. So that's my 100 days. I've loved it. I've had some great classes. I do love that the curriculum is right there and I add me into the curriculum so that it's really great. Um, I have gone through Google Slides um, using my iPad for props, using my phone for props, and I kind of went back old school. I tried using two screens at once and I just liked keeping it simple. Using my very easy um, note cards you know, good old fashioned. This is a farm. Farm. Uh, I found it a lot easier as I'm rifling through things on my desk to have note cards than try to flip back through Google Slides um, with my visual props. I do love using my iPad for virtual rewards and then having my um, dino stars right here. I post my students' names here to give that little extra like, these are your stars. Since we can't give hearts, I give them hearts like, oh, I love that too, you get a heart. And I stick their heart there with my teacher, Christy. So each student gets their own little name put right up there. They pick their favorite color. They can pick a pattern that they want. It's just something personal. Um, so that's something I've learned that I have went back to old school. I'm keeping it simple, keeping it minimal. And those are my 100 day pros. My 100 day oh, cons. I'm feeling a little conflicted right now with this awesome month booking out you accept all four i had like i said six of those that sent to me i was like hooray i wrote it all out i wrote all my schedule out i was teaching two to three classes every single day boom 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 and then dun, 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 memorial day hit and whoosh i have not seen five of my nine students um it's chill it's june 10th i have not seen them in two weeks and there is no way for me to contact parents that i'm aware of um other than saying hey i'm gonna send you an e-card i miss you let's have class i wish there was a way for me to be able to contact parents and say is there something wrong are you okay did i do something is there something that we're missing in class i just poof haven't heard from them 
two weeks. So it makes me a little sad. Um, and with classes that get booked, you get so excited like, oh, tomorrow I have this student, this student, and this student. Well, whoosh, all classes get canceled. There it goes. I, I have made all my materials ready. I have opened my schedule to other things to have those classes and parents just cancel. And it's really frustrating and I understand parents are paying for classes. I want them to have the schedule that is appropriate for them. But when I've prepared my schedule, it's really frustrating to just get classes canceled on you. But in my 100 days, I still have a mostly positive experience. I have joined another teaching platform and it is going fantastic. So I'm kind of in a rough boat with VIP Kid at the moment. I don't want to quit it. I love it. There are so many things that I will just keep going, um, but I'm kind of in a rough patch right now. And there are a lot of people that are feeling that rock of the boat. So I'm just going to hang on, hold in there. Every season has its ups and downs, and I'm kind of just at a plateau for the moment. So we're going to see where do the next hundred days bring us. And if I just keep teaching my awesome three fabulous students that I have been seeing for this week and the last two weeks, then I will teach those three fabulous students and I will give them my all and give them my best. So that's my hundred day reflection. Let me know how you're feeling with your current online teaching situation. Are you happy? Are you feeling positive? Are you feeling that inner turmoil right now? Um, don't forget, hit subscribe, hit like, bye friends.